Hello everyone, welcome to Crochet Life and Stuff with Deborah Presents. Me, Deborah, with some non-crochet stuff, but actually some life stuff. I told you on the Saturday vloggy video that uh, I did a little clothes shopping this past week, and um, not just from traditional stores, went to Goodwill and I found this super cute dress. Ta-da! Pretty floral. Yes, I know we're getting into fall, but we're going to be hot here through September, maybe into October. And besides that, I keep stuff for a long time, so I will be wearing this for quite a while. The brand on it says Covington Woman, says Made in China. It also says Dry Clean Only. I tossed this ish in the wash, okay? And I know why it said Dry Clean Only. The hem was perfectly fine when I tossed it in the wash. When it came out, uh, some of the hem had come undone, which is easy enough to fix um, by hand. So not a big deal. And also the lining in the top looks like it's hand stitched, which I thought was kind of interesting, but it survived the wash. See, it looks like it's hand tacked on there. Anyway, all stuff that's totally fixable, especially for six bucks. Yes, six bucks. Okay, and besides, a little shawl or something would go really nice with that, right? Okay, I gotta stop. I have too much stuff to crochet right now. Setting that aside, big ol' bag back here. And by big ol', I mean, it's not that big a bag. But, here's what we got. I did go to Torrid, or the Torrid Outlet, which... <laughs> I really wish they'd quit trying to call stuff outlets by sticking it in the outlet ball, because it really isn't. Uh, I am a large person. I wear clothes from Torrid, okay? I ended up with a large receipt with a large amount of money. But my Torrid card was paid down to zero, and I will pay it off again this month after doing this. So I don't keep a balance there. Yes, men, avert your eyes. It's a bra. One that converts to strapless. Um, the only strapless one that I have was one from Torrid that is beige, and I needed a black one. So, yeah. Did that. Now on to the actual cute stuff. Okay. I love Halloween. Look at the print. Yes. Colorful webs. Are you kidding me? Love it. Totally love it. They had a whole bunch of like skull themed and Halloween-y type of themed stuff there. Yeah. I know Torrid is not aimed at my age demographic, okay? I don't care. I always find something cute that I absolutely love there. So, yeah. Now, there, but wait, there's more. Okay, this has got to be the softest t-shirt material I have ever felt. And look. It has skulls. Yes, I love that sort of thing. But, oh my gosh, this is the softest material ever. And it's got nice, well, nice wide necklines. So it'll be kind of hanging and dangly on there. Did I buy a size up on this? I did not size up on this one. So it won't be too big. But it's got that curved hem on the bottom. It's going to be just something comfy to wear. And it's kind of long. Actually, even on me, it goes down to booty length. So I'll be able to wear this with some leggings or something. Yeah. But wait, there is more. Of course there's more. I did get something non-skull related. Okay, one thing anyway. Um, I got this cute little top. Yes, I know, it's a tank top, but look at those gorgeous fall colors. Okay. And it's, it's a button up. Not that I will ever, no, actually, it's a fake button up. Love that even better because no chance of those buttons going popping. But yeah, this is something that I can wear, quote, to work in my office in there. Um, especially if I want to put a little jacket over it. If I want to look super uber professional, wear this, small piece of jewelry, a little black jacket because yes, I have those. And then I can still work in my underwear. Hey, perks of working from home, okay? But yeah, I thought the, the pattern on this was really nice. It does have some give. Yes. I love material that has some give. Oh. <laughs> and this. 
which has a piece that goes with it. <laughs> because of course I did. Now, technically, this is sold as a sleep shirt. However, one of the sales ladies there was wearing it to work. And I'm like, yes, I am in your camp, okay? Look at those colors. I love it. It is colorful. It's like a sugar candy skull, a carabeta. Um, and I bought this one a size up, so it'd be kind of loose and comfy. It's cozy on the inside. It's a little bit soft and fleecy, but it's not super fleecy. So I'll be able to get a whole lot more wear out of it because otherwise I get overheated. Now, it is a sleep shirt and it comes with some bottoms, which you know I had to get. They're sold separately, but you know, they're like a matching set because yes, super stretchy. I think I sized up on these too. I did. I sized up on these and um, yeah, it's all good. They're going to be comfy and soft and cozy and covered in skulls. Ah. So do you have the obsession with skulls and Halloween stuff that I do? I know a lot of people don't, but it's something that I have always loved. And a uh, matter of fact, I have a dress that I made sure to pull out at least a couple times a year. It's a really easy to wear pullover dress that I got from Torrid that is covered in skulls and roses. Yes, that and my combat boots. Because that's Deborah. Anyway, that is the end of the bag. And I, I was waiting. I want to put all this stuff in the wash so I can start wearing it. Because yes, always wash stuff that you buy from stores. I have worked in sewing factories before and it's not the sewing factories that are necessarily dirty and stuff but when the material comes in a lot of times the fabric is made overseas and it gets shipped in and sometimes there's things in those shipping containers that you don't want in your fabric so word to the wise always 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 wash your garments when you receive them when you get them before you wear them you know just saying anyhow this is cute how much do you love this? Oh, totally not affiliated. I, I pay my own cashing money for this stuff. And um, I had to get my squishy skull top. <clears throat> I hope it cools off so that I can wear it really soon. I want to wear it out because it flips people out anyway. Because they're all oh, pearl clutch. Anyway, thanks for coming by, looking through my shopping haul. And... Um, Stay tuned for my other content because it's obviously not always closed. It's a lot of crochet and a lot of other stuff. See you soon. Bye-bye.